Hey guys, welcome out to the range. I have literally filmed this video that you're watching right now seven times because I'm trying to find a way to do this in the most distilled fashion possible. Yesterday I was in the comment section on my channel and somebody made a comment mocking me on a video that I released very recently talking about that I was asking for donations just to help keep this channel financially viable and free from corporate intrusion. And I thought that's a really snotty comment from that guy considering that he's watching a channel that's not monetized and he can watch the video he was watching where he made the comment was about a nine and a half minute video and that video is completely 100% ad free. I'll give you an example. Yesterday I was watching a 35 minute video on a subject matter that I know very well but I was kind of curious to see what that presenter's ideas were based on the things that I know about these things. And in that video the presenter had five ads, five. Each ad was no less than 30 seconds. Some of them were 45 seconds and one of them exceeded 60 seconds. And as you guys know, when you're watching a video and they suddenly cut to an ad, it makes you go like that because you're thinking, okay, the guy was literally in the middle of a sentence and then they cut to an ad. And it just sucks the continuity out of the video. And this channel has always been ad free. Um, shortly after starting this channel, back during Obama one, um, I went ahead and I pulled monetization. I didn't like the things that Google AdSense was doing, so I pulled monetization. I do this channel out of pocket for you guys because truth matters. And I wanna make sure that you guys have access to the most concise information possible. And the only way to do that is for me to say, I'm funding this channel out of pocket. So for the first time, I am boldly just flat out going to say, guys, I need your help. Financially, I need your support. Um, uh, I ran some numbers last night and actually had a good giggle fest about this one, but I thought I'd share it with you anyways. Um, I ran the basic numbers based on my, um, uh, on, on my subscribership. 59,864 subscribers. If each of you donated just 20 bucks. We're talking about $1,197,280. Look, if each of you dated, if, if each of you donated like a buck 50, okay, we're talking no less than $59,864. And the reason I say buck 50 is you always lose a considerable chunk with credit card fees and whatnot. So guys, even a, like literally a donation of like five bucks does so much for this channel. You have no idea because I have never had any help whatsoever on this channel. There are times, my friend Brian, the owner of AIM Surplus will tell you, there are times where I have gotten in my car at 4.35 in the morning, driven all the way to Ohio, where AIM Surplus is, picked up a vehicle full of ammo, turned around and driven back the same day. Why? Because I do not trust shipping ammunition through the mail. I do not trust shipping firearms through the, the shipping system because things just keep falling off trucks. Do you know what that costs? Okay, you guys don't pay for it, I do, I suck it up. Because I believe in giving you guys 100% unfettered truth on this channel. But I cannot continue to support this financially. It is killing me. So what I'm asking of you, and actually guys, the bigger picture of what it is that I'm after is this land that we're on right now is owned by my friend Don. He's kind, he's generous, and he gives me access to this land. I would like to be able to have a piece of land similar to this where I can have an overland course where you can actually go through the woods in your own vehicle. And we would have steel targets everywhere. Guys, this, remember, I've already built that here on Don's land. There are steel targets all over these woods for the overland course. Um, but I want to have an overland course that you can actually drive vehicles through, 100% the whole way through. Um, varied terrain, different things, um, short range, long range, vehicle obstacle, dragging things with your vehicle. So truly merging overland and tactical into one thing. This is actually something that I talked with someone years ago who's actually into overland and he came to me and he says, I want your knowledge to merge overland into tactical. And then the guy kind of dropped off the radar and went and did his own thing. And I'm like, okay, well, so much for that idea. Guys, I want to bring it to fruition because it really matters. Because I think it's a sport that's really missing in our, in our industry. And so to do so, I need funding. And I'm asking you guys to get on tier1citizen.com, go to the support tier one citizen page, run that slider as high as you want, guys. There's no donation that I will scoff at. Run that slider as low or as high as you want. But I'm, I'm asking you, please, make a donation. 
Um, people ask me, well, why don't you have a Patreon page? Guys, I release content every four days. I don't have time for a Patreon page because Patreon requires that I have content for everybody else and content just for my Patreons, or my, my, my patrons, sorry, my patrons. I don't have time to be creating double content. So what I ask of you is, for the first time ever, I'm boldly asking, please, help support Tier 1 Citizen. Help this channel go from being a YouTube channel to actually being a live and vibrant community where shooters from all over can come and train. Because what I will tell you is this, and I'll close with this. I live in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Every time I go train, I gotta drive somewhere. I've gotta drive, if I'm lucky, I'm only driving three and a half hours to um, Valor Ridge or Personal Survival Solutions in Harrogate, Tennessee or Clarksville, Tennessee. That's short, okay, that's a short drive. From there, it turns into seven hours to um, um, uh, Tactical Defense Institute in West Union, Ohio, or, or uh, Jeepers, or handgun combatives where I used to train, uh, Dave is retired now. But I wanna train at Thunder Ranch. My friend Philip lives out there. I'm like, dude, I cannot suck up four grand to go to Thunder Ranch because it's the cost of the class, the cost of the ammunition, the cost of, of either flying out there or driving out there. So it's either airfare or gasoline. That's a forerunner. They don't get good gas mileage. All that ammo, all the weapons, hotels, food, da 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 da. Conservatively, $4,000 for me to get from here to Oregon and back. I can't afford that. I want to go train with uh, CSAT in Nacogdoches, Texas. I can't afford. Guys, I have, uh, as, of, as of the filming of this video, I am just within days of getting married. Um, I've, got a, I've got a wife just around the corner. I've got two kids that need me all the time. I drove them to school this morning. I've got, young ch I've got young children again with this, uh, with this pending marriage, right? I, I live the same life you guys do. The difference is Tier 1 Citizen is a community and we have the ability as a community to aggregate our dollars and make something amazing happen and I'm gonna do it right here in this area of Tennessee. Um, Georgetown, Birchwood, somewhere close to Chattanooga where you guys can actually come train without the range Nazi walking up and down the line telling you that you can't shoot faster than one round per second and all that other foolishness. So uh, one more time this video has gotten way too stinking long. Like I said I filmed this video seven times now but guys this is coming from the heart. I want to do something great with Tier 1 Citizen and I want to make Tier 1 Citizen something real that you can enjoy past watching something on your screen. I'm asking for your support. Please do so. Tier1Citizen.com, please make your donations. I would greatly appreciate it. And please know that I am in your corner. I'm in the same fight that you guys are. You're trying to stretch your dollars and figure out how to make ends meet. I'm there. As always, thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. And by the way, if nothing changes, if donations don't come, please know this channel will continue to be supported by me. I will make sure that I do not allow the content to falter on this channel because you guys matter to me. God bless you all. Have a good one. Time to shoot.